Tom Cruise and um, Katie Holmes are divorcing. You've probably read about this or got an update on your phone like I did because I like to be updated with all the, the important things in life. I mean, if you didn't see it coming, I feel really bad for you. Everyone else knew that it was just a business deal because Tom Cruise's gang can't have children. It got me to thinking about Surrey Cruise, who is an Aries, supposedly. But it's also pretty much a fact that Surrey is not Tom Cruise's child in the first place and was probably born three months before. So we won't really be able to tell that anyway, I guess, until she grows up and becomes an overprivileged cokehead whore that gets roles in movies even though she doesn't deserve them. Fucking amazing and think that they're just like the, these ridiculous alpha males that have all these skills. But then you spend the whole time like in all these strange positions and you're like, what am I doing? Why is my like, over here? Can we just fuck like normal? Oh my gosh, that's like, funny. It's so bad. Like seriously. I've never had pleasurable sex with an Aries man because it's always all about them. Always. It's like Hi, like let me like I'm an Aries and I'm here to service you. Oh, wait, no, actually you're looking at yourself in the mirror while you're fucking you. <laughs> what like Christian fuck? Bale in American Psycho. Exactly. <laughs> like, I can hear Susu Studio playing in the oh, background. Oh, like, oh, had... <laughs> well, yes, this is why I hate Aries. <laughs> this is why Amy and you should, too. <laughs> Was that all recorded? <laughs> yeah. I like Aries. Um... They're the most selfish of all the signs. They only think about themselves. And you can say that, like, yeah, it's a good thing because they're looking out for themselves before they look out for anybody else. But in reality, like, it's a horrible fucking thing because they only look out for themselves. And they don't give a shit about anybody else. <laughs> I've never had sex with an Aries. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, it's, like, really hard to enjoy a conversation with someone who somehow keeps turning it back on themselves. And then, like... They always do this devil's advocate thing. No, it's not a devil's advocate thing, because they don't really know how to play that game. They're not that smart. It's more of a... They will argue with you about anything. Everything becomes an argument until um, eventually they start agreeing with you. And then instead of telling you that they agree with you because their minds are so easily swayed, they like to pretend like that that's what they were talking about the entire time. So it's like you have an opinion, they have an opinion, you're yelling at each other, and then they're like, that's what I was saying, you didn't even understand me. The whole time and then it's just fucking stupid and you're like you're you're an idiot and I don't even know what to say to you because you probably are the dumbest sign in the zodiac and that sucks for you it's embarrassing but you all think you're the smartest because you're the only thing that you can see like you're like oh I hate stupid people but you're fucking stupid so I don't even understand that Aries girls for the most part are really big tomboys like they don't wear a lot of makeup they don't do a lot of things they're kind of like harsh they when they walk they hit the ground like this also sounds like airy sex, doesn't it? Yeah, kind of. No, it's more like this. <laughs> oh, that was so good. <laughs> oh, you, I, was that good for you? I don't fucking care. It was awesome for me. It was like I just masturbated. Do you feel that? Do I feel that? Do you feel that? And it's like, yes, I feel that. You're fucking drilling my vagina like your dick is a jackhammer. And no, yeah, I feel it, but it doesn't feel good. You're masturbating Seriously? with my vagina. <laughs> you are using my... You were using my vagina as some sort of like pocket pussy. It's disgusting. <laughs> like I can't tell you how bad it is. Really, this should just be like Alyssa and why she hates every sign, and then Amy's sexual interpretation of the sign. sign. Because I had sex with every sign. sign. I know. Like, at least multiple times. That is. One day I'll, I'll introduce you to Amy oh, more. Thanks. Maybe, maybe well, we'll do I a don't good video. Like a hungover piece of shit. Yeah, we're pretty hungover. It was our bachelorette party. Oh, my, my. <laughs> well, you're getting married with I me, mean, aren't you? I feel like it was mine. When am I getting married? I'm getting married in like two days. So, I haven't even really thought about that yet. Um, well, some of them have crooked dicks. Actually, that just might be the one that I had sex with. Yeah, you and your crooked dicks. <laughs> don't come near me with your selfish crooked dicks. <laughs> Selfish I'm just really glad I'm not an Aries. I am too. They probably really hate themselves when you really think about it. Because anyone that, like, is that fucking pompous and stupid really can't have a high opinion of themselves. It's so, it's so ridiculous how fucking cocky like, they are. Sure you they are themselves? Yeah. They're, they're like, so sure. And yet, and you're like, dude, you must be covering up for something. Either a small penis or... Something else, or if you're a girl, maybe you're like, you're just super stupid. But you really do think you are the smartest, best looking, most perfect people in the entire world. And I'm sorry, most Aries aren't even that attractive.
when you when you when you've taken Aries because their faces are just kind of angled and plain next to like another sign, they are the sign that does not stand out. I have never really met that much of an attractive Aries. Actually, they'll have something about them, but they're not attractive. They look like the girls look like men, and the men look like pompous douchebags. <laughs> Hi, my name's Alyssa. This is Apollo. We put out a new video every Wednesday and Monday and Friday in that particular order. <laughs> so subscribe to my channel and you won't you won't regret it. Um, I'm Apollo. Hi! Say goodbye, Apollo. Do your little Apollo dancey thingy. <gasps> okay, bye.